And this video mga kahit ituturo ko na po sa inyo kung paano mag-aay ng second router sa ating TLDP modem router or any ISP modem router na hindi na kailangan ng LAN table. Ano ang kakailanganin to make this possible? Pwede ba kahit anong router lang? Like this? No! 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 What we need po is a router that has a Wi-Fi extender feature. We like to make a multi-sys router. Ang kagandaan nito ka IP is you can have this for less than 800 pesos only. Check nyo lang po yung link sa description box. Ito po ay 4 antennas router. Nakamumi mo na po yan. Hindi nga lang gigabit ang WAN at LAN port nito. Pero ito po ay dual band router. Meaning to say, it supports 2.4 and 5 gigahertz Wi-Fi. To set this up, kung may Wi-Fi po ang PC ninyo or laptop, hindi mo na kailangan ng LAN cable or Ethernet cable. You can even use your smartphone to configure this router. Let's start the configuration. Ang una lang po natin gawin is to connect the power adapter, syempre sa power outlet po natin. And then hintayin po natin na iilaw ang Wi-Fi LED light ng ating Mercuses router. Kung umilaw, nakakonect tayo sa Wi-Fi ng Mercuses. The password is at the bottom of our Mercuses router. Input the password and connect. Once connected, na open tayo ng web browser. Sa web address bar, type lang po natin mwlogin.net. Kahit walang internet access mga ka IP, you can still open this URL. So wag po kayo mag-alala kung wala kayong internet connection sa ngayon. You will be prompted to create new password. Click Let's Get Started. Select your time zone. So uh, kahit anong country dyan mga ka IP, basta naka plus 8 lang po kung walang Pilipinas. Skip lang po muna natin ito. Set up your Wi-Fi. Next. Next. Wait until the process is done. So, no internet po tayo mga ka -IT, pero okay lang po yan. Skip lang. Para ma-energy po tayo magpatuloy, suntukin muna ang like button. Now, navigate sa advance. Select this range extender mode. Save and reboot the Mercuses router. Log in to Mercuses Admin using your new admin password. You will see these settings. Piliin nyo kung ano ang SSID or Wi-Fi name ang gusto po ninyong i-extend. And this guide, I will choose this free virus. Ito po yung sa PLDT Modem Router Wi-Fi ko. It will ask your main router's Wi-Fi password. In this case, ang password ng free virus Wi-Fi ko. It is important to input the correct Wi-Fi password or else it will fail. Click OK. It will automatically scan for 5 GHz Wi-Fi. You have the option to skip but I recommend to set it up as well. Same process lang. Select the 5 GHz Wi-Fi that you want to extend. Input the password of that Wi-Fi. Click OK. Dito, you can change your Wi-Fi extender SSIDs or Wi-Fi name and passwords. But I just leave it as is. Click next. You can review it here. And click back if you want to change anything. Kung wala naman, let's just save. Now, the settings will be applied. You can save this QR code for easy Wi-Fi access. So, wala pang internet connection. To complete the setup, connect either of the two Wi-Fi extender SSIDs. Check this, I have connected to the extended network. Click finish. You will my internet connection na ka-ID. Now, login po tayo sa ating Mercuses dashboard. If you see connected status, it means you got it right. And you just successfully set up your Mercuses router as Wi-Fi extender to your PLDT or ISP modem router's Wi-Fi. Shoutout nga pala sa mga sulid ka-IT po natin, kay Randolph Saison, Simple Basics, and Be Amazed. And of course, sa mga naging client po natin, kay Ma'am Julian Blanco, matagal lang po natin itong naging client mga ka-IT. Siyempre, hindi pa huli ang ever-loyal po natin, 
na klayan si Ma'am Mary Ann Crosana Levanes. Pero mas gusto niya pong tawagin na May Ann. Maraming salamat po sa inyong suporta at tiwala. May problema ba kayo sa router, computer at network ninyo? Meron po tayong tech consultation mga ka PM lang sa FB page po natin Kuya IT Official. 66% less po or discount sa mga YT subscribers.